Thomas here, and today we're doing a quick review on the Ozotech Poseidon 200 Ozone Kit. It's like a snowman made out of cardboard boxes. If you're looking to get into ozone to clarify your tank, increase light penetration, help mitigate chemical warfare between corals, while also raising the ORP with a kit that includes all the essentials and is built to last a lifetime, the Poseidon 200 kit is the BRS recommended solution that you're looking for. Having crystal clear water in her tanks is a goal shared by many a reefer. Clear water looks amazing, helps the color of our fish and corals pop, while providing the illusion that our fish are floating on air. Having clear water also helps more than you might realize with light penetration. Most reefers turn to carbon to keep the water clear, remove chemicals and odors due to the fact that it's relatively inexpensive and it's very easy to use. But select reefers turn to the oxidizing power of ozone. Ozone generators do a fantastic job of quickly and consistently clarifying the tank by oxidizing the yellow pigments in the water, breaking them down to a smaller colorless form. Ozone is also credited with breaking down toxic chemicals produced by corals, mitigating coral warfare, and creating an environment where they are able to thrive regardless of who their neighbors are, resulting in better polyp extension and fluffier looking corals. And of course, also removing bad odors and raising the ORP. Ozotech has been a leader in ozone for 30 plus years. They have phenomenal customer service and are the pioneers of their patented cold spark corona discharge technology, creating systems for industrial and commercial applications. The Poseidon 200 kit is not your average hobby grade ozone system. It consistently outperforms the competition, especially in its price range, and provides you with a workhorse team of essential gear to start implementing ozone on your tank. In the kit, you'll find the Ozotech Poseidon 200 generator, the Ozotech air dryer with a generous amount of silica drying beads, lengths of ozone resistant tubing and fittings, and the Milwaukee ORP controller with included probe. The kit includes everything you need to safely get started running ozone on your tank and setup is straightforward. The Poseidon 200 has an inlet and an outlet. The air dryer is attached to the inlet so that it can reduce the moisture of the air prior to entering the ozone generator. Then from the outlet, the line runs to a check valve and then to your protein skimmer Venturi. The skimmer will draw air through the ozone generator and mix it thoroughly into the water, acting as a reactor. Some skimmers actually have a dedicated port for ozone. If that's your skimmer, you can use that. Otherwise, you can attach it to the top of your skimmer's air silencer. The ozone generator's power supply is then plugged into the ORP controller's relay. This allows the ORP controller to monitor the amount of ORP in the tank and shut off the ozonator if it starts exceeding 375, keeping it in a safe range. It is important to keep in mind that ozone will degrade plastics that aren't rated for use with ozone. The kit includes ozone safe tubing and fittings, but if for any reason you want to customize the setup, make sure to use Kylar fittings and ozone resistant tubing. It is also a good idea to double check that your protein skimmer is going to be compatible with ozone. If you don't have an answer in the owner's manual, you can always shoot a quick email or message over to the manufacturer and that usually does the trick. The Ozotech air dryer included in the kit is solid and has a generous volume of color changing silica beads to remove excess moisture from the air before it goes into the Poseidon 200. You can mount it under your stand, but due to the humidity in stands with some filtration, it is best to run the tubing outside of the stand to draw air from the room if possible. Once the beads are saturated with moisture, they'll change from blue to pink to indicate that they're exhausted and need to be recharged by baking them in an oven at low temperature to dry them out. Once they're back to blue, they're ready to go. There are also auto recharging dryers available if you have particularly humid air or just want to automate it for a hands-off approach. The Ozotech Poseidon is what I would consider to be a professional grade ozone generator capable of producing 220 milligrams an hour with usable airflow rates. It is built solid with a power coated aluminum housing that incorporates keyhole mounts on the back for both vertical and horizontal mounting. It utilizes Ozotech's patented cold spark corona discharge technology and is easily adjusted by the knob on the front, allowing you to dial in the ozone production to meet your needs and minimize the amount of on off cycles the ORP controller has to perform, leading to a more consistent ORP level in the tank. Like you'd expect from professional grade equipment, the Corona Discharge Cell is serviceable and replaceable. Ozotech makes a cleaning kit available as well as replacement cells should you need one, so the generator will keep running strong for the entire life of the tank. 
The Milwaukee ORP controller included in the kit is solid and will reliably prevent you from accidentally adding too much ozone by shutting off the generator if the ORP gets too high. It comes with a probe and is factory calibrated and ready to go right out of the box and is surprisingly easy to set up and use despite looking like a complex piece of lab equipment. It's not complex, but I'm sure it is also lab equipment. This kit appeals to me a lot more than an all-in-one ozonator ORP controller. It definitely takes up more space, don't get me wrong, but the fact that all the components are separate and easily serviceable means that this is going to be a long-term investment that I'm confident is gonna last versus something that if one thing breaks on it, then the whole system's kaput. If I was going to run ozone on my tank, this is definitely the route I would go and perhaps even take it a step further with one of those automatic air dryers. Before implementing ozone on your system, it is a really good idea to understand exactly how ozone works, what it's really good for, what its limitations are, and how to set it up safely, not only for your inhabitants in your tank, but also for you and your family at home, which leads me to knowing exactly what ozone smells like, which Ryan is gonna tell you all about right here. Very accurate description of the smell in that video. It's like bang on. It smells just like that. And I'm glad I know. <laughs> 